So I just thought I'd show you some things about Planet for if you want to be a Japanese designer. So if you go to the configurations, you can um, have the minus button set to select languages. But more important than that is that there's a tapping version that if you use two fingers to tap the screen, it selects the language as well. And something interesting is that these both of these can be used anywhere on the game. So you could tap in like the home screen or in the naming scene or in settings. All of the areas will allow you to change the name, the language, even in like the context, I mean the user manual. Um, other than that, when you're um, in Japanese, there's a couple fonts you can pick from that let the kanji look a little bit different. Um, I just went through them. Anyway, so yeah, when you play the game, it um, will have a Japanese and you just need to tap it or click the button at the top and it'll switch back and forth and it works in the settings of the game real well. So you can just tap the screen if you're confused and the Dongopedia doesn't work in the Japanese version, which is kind of funny. Uh, other than that, these are not direct translations, but they're pretty close to um, what they're saying. Like uh, this one right here, he doesn't specifically say that he's late, but it's insinuated that he's late because any respectable student would do this. So the meanings are basically the same, but it's, you can't really use this as a word for word translation in certain areas. So it's good to double check. Um, so like, this is what he's trying to say. But uh, you can't like just go to the English version and be like, yes, that's what this word means type of thing. So you would need a um, dictionary for reading Tomoyo's lines.